Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. My name is Gerald and today I will be talking to you about our 360 accessories, how these will make your life easier while shooting. So all the accessories are here. I will start with the Baby Popeye. Small magnetic base, perfect to mount on any metal surfaces. So why I like this one in particular, because it has a pull force of 12 kilos, small diameter so you can use it as a small tripod and it will not be visible in your 360 shot so let me show you with the camera camera is here a very small magnetic mount let me show you i'll stick it right now on the board no problem fits well so let me continue with the popeye full size popeye so this one is very powerful I uh, mainly use it to mount on cars, just this one and a monopod, your 360 camera on it, a pull force of 42 kilos, it has a lot of traction, I've used it at very high speed, it holds well. Uh, here is in comparison with the size, perfect, very strong. Guys be careful with uh, Popeye, full size Popeye, because uh, 42 kilos of pull force might not seem like a lot, but if you have two of them, that's 84 kilos and if you have your finger in between that will pinch you and you will regret it so please guys be careful with this yeah i will continue with the counterweight cw1 counterweight one which is the first one we produced of 300 grams this is a very good addition to your monopod if you don't have any counterweight that is very important because you don't want your camera to go smashing to the ground you want your monopod to be nice and sturdy camera on top all the weight must be on the bottom. I will move on to the 400 gram, the counterweight 2, CW2. Once again, if you're shooting with your monopod at full height, you want a counterweight absolutely because you don't want your camera crashing to the ground. And the counterweight does make a difference. Please don't forget about it. You can use whatever equipment, but always a counterweight, always a counterweight. It's well worth the money spent to not have your camera crashing. We'll move on to the Counterweight Pro. So the Counterweight Pro is a huge improvement over the basic 300 and 400 gram. Why? Because there's much more technology involved in this one and it does make a difference at the end of the day when you're shooting over and over again. So let me give you some details. Of course the black, so no reflecting with the light into, back into the lens. Anti-slip O-rings on the top and bottom. Quarter inch female threads on the bottom. There are four of them, one in the center for normal vertical positioning of your monopod the 10 degree 25 degree and the 45 degree the 45 degree you screw it in on your tripod you have your counterweight holding your monopod at a set 45 degree then there's a passage for a cable a small groove uh, for a cable if you're doing some live shooting or you want to power up your camera and have the cable stuck sturdy on the bottom of your tripod you have at least this option. Let's move on to my right and I will start with the spacer, Bushman Panamax spacer. Small little accessory, useful to separate your camera from the base. If you do have some plugs underneath the camera or some buttons, or if you need to give some distance uh, between the base and the camera to have a smaller footprint in your 360 shot. This is why we enjoy the quarter inch spacer. Let's move on to the compass level, basic compass on one side a level on the other and a tightening ring on the bottom so this one is very important because if you do want to shoot and in your 360 shot you do want to see the compass and the level for reference later on the police use this for example you can do so and you place your camera as you wish or hidden very simple or visible in your 360 shot now the ground spike. Ground spike is perfect if you want to shoot without using your tripod and have a smaller footprint. Tripod is out, in the down shot, in the nadir, you do not see the legs. So this can work in cracks, in sand, on the ice. It has a quarter inch male thread on the top and three eighths if you do want to use it on a bigger tripod. In addition, it has a hole here. So if you do get it stuck in a crack in a tree, for example, you can use another appliance to untighten it or actually to tighten it if you did the need to. So very easy. This is perfect in the sand when you don't want to get your tripod in the sand and have to wash your tripod afterwards. So 
The ground spike is one piece, no mechanical part, perfect in the sand. Let me talk to you about the bender. This is a really cool accessory because it will fit in many, many conditions and help you very often. It has so many possibilities with a ball head on the bottom and on the top. Quarter inch female thread on the bottom, quarter inch male thread on the top. So you can put it on a base, you can attach it to a monkey clamp, a Popeye, and you can orient your camera, monopod, with this at all times. Very easy to tighten, it's really perfect and helps a lot. This one we've used it many times, for example with the Bushman Monopod Pro and the tripod. We use three benders on the tripod and on the bottom Popeyes on the base on three metal parts bent in all direction. It really helps out and helps you shoot in 360. The monkey clamp, a useful accessory that I use regularly that you will most probably find useful to clamp down on any surface. For example, you want to shoot with your 360 camera, put your monopod on it, the camera on top, put it on your bike, on a handrail, or for example, if it's windy and you want to use it on your monopod pro as a second mounting solution, to, hand, uh, to hold on a handrail or any other surface, you have your tripod here, use this one as a second mounting point. Perfect, ideal, small and practical. That's it for the accessories. There's another accessory I didn't talk to you about is the quick release. And we did a separate video for this one that was posted not long time ago. You can always go back to it. You can find a link in the description below. These are all the Bushman accessories. Let us know how you use your accessories, which ones are the most useful for you. If there's some accessories that you would like to see in the Bushman lineup, let me know. I will be glad to develop them and work on this. Thanks guys for watching. If you liked the video, please give us a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, give us two thumbs up. We appreciate it. Subscribe if you haven't done so already and I'll see you in the next video.